Alrighty guys, Jane Poop back with more, uh, so more playthrough of Resident Evil, the original, uh, on the PS1, <laughs> Sega Saturn, uh, but I'm on the, uh, Director's Cut DualShock PS1 version, so, um, now you may recall we've finished it already, uh, for some of you, uh, uh, so, uh, but we're going to do the game again, but this time with a different character, so, again, you can enter your code here if you want. Uh, I don't know what it is. Okay, I don't know what code it was, but it changes green whenever you enter a code, so, yeah. Uh, on range mode, so, I'm gonna do it on, um, beginner mode again, because, obviously, uh, we want to make it easier as possible, so here we go, with some... We've done it with Jill last time, um, so we've done it with Jill Valentine last time, now we're doing it with Chris Redfield, the most common, iconic character in Resident Evil history. So let's -a go! Watch this cutscene. Alpha Team is flying around the forest zone, situated in northwest Raccoon City, where we're searching for the helicopter of our compatriots, Bravo Team, who disappeared during the middle of our mission. No, I haven't found it yet. Bizarre murder cases have recently occurred in Raccoon City. There are outlandish reports of families being attacked by a group of about ten people. Victims were apparently eaten. Bravo team went to the hideout of the group and disappeared. Look, Chris! It was Bravo team's helicopter. Nobody was in it. But strangely, most of the equipment was still there. However, we soon discovered why. Stars members left now. Captain Wesker, Jill, and myself. We don't know where Barry is. Chris Redfield. Resident 
evil. They have escaped into the mansion. Where they thought it was safe. Yet. I don't know what happened. Barry, where's Barry? Well, I'm sorry, but he's probably... No. What is that? I'll go and check. Okay, Jill and I will stay in the hall in case of an emergency. Chris? Take care. Alright then. <laughs> you should have replied back, Chris. Now, now the gameplay is similar, but the stories are slightly different with Chris. Uh, obviously, you have different cutscenes, but you have slightly different gameplay as well. Uh, you can see we have less slots than Jill, so... So that means we're gonna have to backtrack a lot more in this one. So... And we only have the knife, for now. Uh, right here. There's no blood this time. We can still, we're still gonna collect this. The emblem. Uh, the gameplay is the same, uh, basically. It's just, um... It's just that, uh, with, uh, Chris, um... It's slightly harder. You could consider Jill as easy mode and then Chris as hard mode. Even the Japanese version says that when you highlight them in the characters. Kenneth's death again. Decapitated head because this is the uncut version. Yeah, in the censored version, you do not see that part. Oh, just gonna. Oh! Come on. Alright. There we go. We're gonna get those two clips again. He's Kenneth from the Stars Bravo team. Now he's a mere shadow of the former self. So get these two clips. Um, again, in beginner mode, you still get more things than usual. So that's still a good thing. So there we go. Oh, you can move the zombie. This zombie always comes back to life. Regardless of how many hits you give to that zombie, he always comes back to life. No matter, no matter what you do. So... There's no way you can uh, permanently kill him. It don't matter because we're heading out the room anyway to find out Jill and Wesker are gone. Wesker? Jill? I have no idea. But I think I think Jill left her gun here. Yep, it's Jill's gun. I think she left it here. The, or the Beretta. Is it meant to be Benetta? Or or I don't know how you say it, but And over here again you can find ink ribbons. And yeah, our items are full uh to start with, so isn't that a good thing? No. Okay. So we're going to do what we did before, uh, we're going to start by going this way. Uh, so we don't know where Barry is still, so... We're going to have to, um... Uh, do this solo, I guess. Or do we? We don't know. Uh, the zombies here, again, I still like to kill them that way. With the, um... Oh, I killed him already, wow. I'm gonna wait for the other to come up. I'm gonna wait for the other because. Obviously. Um, right, I think he's coming. Yeah, because the auto aiming is in effect. There we go, he's behind there. Come on. Oh my god. Ah, oh, kill them. There we go. And I also realized, in my Jill playthrough, I had not died at all. I just realized that now. So let's hope we don't have- let's see if we can have a no death run here as well with Chris. Alright, uh, there's also more enemies in Chris's story, so... You gotta be careful more, so... Okay. We go one two three boom right he's still moving so okay. 
Oh crap. Okay. Alright, there we go. Do 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 Reload. Alright, I'm gonna use the knife here so I can get them. There we go. There we go, we killed them all. Again, zombies don't come back uh, once you defeat them, except for a few, uh, except for a few enemies which are like near the end of the game. Uh, so, but aside from those ones, every enemy does not come back. There's a zombie there, and there's a zombie there. Okay. One, two, three. Shoot, shoot, shoot. Okay. I'll shoot him as well. I'm gonna use the knife to then. Or. Oh, I killed them, okay. Uh, is there any other zombies around here before heading off? Oh, there's one there, okay. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. I thought. Okay. Right, he's still there, okay. He's still alive, okay. Oh, get off me, you piece of shit. There we go. And we're still fine, oh my god. Uh, unlike Jill as well, Chris does not have a lockpick, so you have to collect uh, keys in order to open certain things where items will be in. So, yeah, you have to do that as well. Whoa, what is it? What? Oh, oh no! Sorry. I didn't mean to do that. <laughs> you must be from the Bravo team. Yes, I'm Rebecca. Rebecca Chambers. I'm a newcomer. I just joined the Stars Bravo team last month. Well, I'm really sorry. Are you all right? Yes. I'm Chris Redfield from the Alpha team. Are you the only person here from the Bravo team? Well, because the helicopter made a forced landing, I just ran into this house anyway, but I, uh... I see. There's nothing else you could have done anyway. It's good you're here. Yes, sir. But it's strange. I serviced the helicopter recently, but something went wrong with the engine. It was such a short flight. Huh. And I saw something glow. And it's it's a key that we don't have enough room because we got too much. <laughs> okay, go in the item. Right, uh, we got more clips. I'll put the incrimins away. In fact, th there were actually more incrimins. I think there's another incrimin actually. I'll get that first. Or or is there? Oh no, there isn't in this room. Unless there was with Jill, but not with Chris. Maybe some items have also changed. Um. Okay, I get it now. Um. Right, we don't need that yet, or that, and I don't need the, um, that, so, okay. Can combine these. There we go. Uh, what happens if we talk to Rebecca again? <laughs> Not the item box! No! I wonder if everybody is... Is what? I don't know. Well, let's get this key then on the bed. The mansion key is a golden one as well. Um, unless there's something like yeah, vi uh, vitamins or vitamins and serums. Okay. Well, I guess we'll see Rebecca Chambers later. Well, what should I do now? If you go out to search for the other members, how about letting me come with you? Will you take Rebecca with you? Um, no. <laughs> okay, no. Yes, we will. All right. Let's do it. Yes, sir. I'll do my best. I have to prepare something. Would you like to go ahead? Yeah, I'll go ahead. So, yeah. So, kind of similar to how Jill has Barry as a support, uh, Chris has Rebecca Chambers now. Um... Uh, and also, unlike uh, Jill's playthrough, you cannot play as Barry at all. In Chris's playthrough, there are times where you might have to play as Rebecca Chambers. One, 
is required, and the other, it depends on the how you play. So, it's locked. A carving on the armor. Okay. Right, so that mansion key is a golden one, I believe. So, I believe we still. Oh, whoa, 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 there's a zombie there. Oh my god. Oh, whoa, there's a zombie there as well. Oh my god. <laughs> Tons of zombies. Oh no. <laughs> th th that's not a gun. That's the gun. Okay. Shoot the zombies in the face. Why won't they die? And I shot that for no fucking reason. Alright. And he's still alive. Shit. Oh, thank god. Yay, I killed him! And I'm still fine. Uh, we don't have enough... Uh, well, we don't have something to use to go in that room, but I know what it is, so... At least we kill those zombies out of the way. There's another zombie there. Let's try and snort behind him. Or not, because uh, he's chasing me now. Oh my god! Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh, he bit me. Come on. Come on. Oh, fuck off. Come on. Right, I'm on caution. I best use my gun. Oh shit, I lost an ammo. Okay, um... Is there anything... No. You've unlocked it, so we've unlocked a door. Um, if we try... Let's try and go in that piano room and see what we can do. Can Chris play the piano? I don't know. Let's see if he can. You've used the mansion key. Oh, the... I forgot you could... I forgot you use a mansion key for this room. And then let's get the uh, note, which we push this again, and then we get it here. Will you take the music notes? Yes. And then we're going to go and try and use them. Chris unfortunately can't read music. Oh, it's because he's a man or something. <laughs> Sexist. He's trying. It's me, Chris. Is that you, Rebecca? Ah, oh, it's the Moonlight Sonata. Can you play? Interpretation is off a little. Chris, may I practice for a while? Will you have Rebecca practice? Yes. See? Just relax and play. Alright. And so, so while Rebecca practices, we're going to fuck off and do a a anything else. So, uh, everything else we need to do. So, uh, let's uh, go to that room where the zombie's in the cupboard. Uh, before reading the notes, so uh, let's do that. Uh, so um, I need to reload first off. Okay, here we go. You have used the mansion key. I don't know why I said it like that. Oh my god. So let's go in this room and do that. Um, well, found some clips again. 106. Oh my god. Go here, uh, Chris. There we go. And then hold the trigger button, and then immediately shoot. Okay, lovely. That's good. And he's still alive. Oh my god. Let's use the knife. There we go. He's dead. Keep a diary. I'm not going to read this. We've read it before, anyway. I'm not really going to read these. These are just like 
pointless stories or useful tips, but still. Um, there's blood on the floor, and there's something else here. Uh, shells. This is for the shotgun, but we don't have the shotgun yet, so... Um... Okay. Uh, let's see uh, if we can uh, go back to Rebecca Chambers from here and see if we can still... We can still hear the, the practice in. Because usually you wait for a while before going back. So, let's see. No, she's still practicing, right. We have to do, like, many other things before going back here. So, let's get that uh, crystal from the, um, from that, uh, from the statue we just pushed. So, let's get that, and so then that's out of the way. Yeah, we'll have to back, we have to backtrack a lot due to the amount of items we have, so... There's nothing in sight. No, not that, Chris! We need to get this! Uh, the blue jewel, yes. Uh, we definitely need that. Um, I'm going to go to that statue. So then, since I need to put some things away, so... I don't know if I've heard a zombie crawling or not. It might be the same one that killed Kenneth, I don't know. Right, it's here. Alright, and then we're gonna go here. I'm gonna quit my gun and then. There we go. There we go. And then we get this uh, the uh, wind crest. Uh, we need these crests to again to go to the courtyard, so. So we're gonna get them. In fact, we'll, we'll try and get some of these, or try and get most things done. Uh, until we don't, we can't really do anything. We need to go back to Rebecca to um, continue on. So, yeah, uh, that was me slipping my tea. Okay, let's go back to the item box, and will music play this time? Yay, it does! Okay, the proper save music. Um, uh, we don't need this yet, so we don't need the uh, shotgun shells yet and all, so... So, we're just gonna... Uh, I think that's everything. So, yeah, we only have two slots remaining, so... Do do. All right, let's uh, go the long way this time. I don't know why I'm doing that, but uh, and we're just gonna. And I think uh, Chris's playthrough seems to be the. Uh, the definitive way of playing Resident Evil for most people, for some people. Because it's more action-based with Chris, I believe. Since Jill is more easier to use than Chris, so... And Chris is the harder to use, so... Uh, let's go to the, um... The, uh... uh the balcony area. Where we meet, uh... The dead corpse again, so... And what was that I just saw? I have no idea. Okay. Uh, because here... Oh, we just get clips this time. We don't get the bazooka anymore. Okay. Yep. It's Forrest, he's been pecked by... Pecked to death by crows. And the crows are still here. Uh, by the way, the crows can hurt you. Oh, I don't know if these crows can specifically, but crows can hurt you, so... They're not like crows in real life, where they just fuck off whenever you go near them. Uh, whether you're a kid or not, <laughs> they still go away. So, I think they're nice crows, the ones in real life. And then the ones in uh, the games, or e uh, the games and movies and all that, not just Resident Evil, but any other thing that has crows in it, are evil. Shoot. Shoot. There we go. 
And he's still alive. Oh my god. Oh, he's dead. Lovely. I killed him. Ha 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 ha. And there's one there. Okay. So then that says five then. Okay. Oh shit, I wasted an ammo. And he's still alive. Of course he would. Come on, kill him. There we go. Lovely. Go in this door. So we can find something useful. So a book. Of course. Up the book. The botani the botani book. Um <coughs> oh boy, I just burped. You unlocked it. Okay. Oh god, I got uh, cups. Oh, there's a zombie there. Oh my god. Okay. And he's still alive. Oh, you're not even close, Chris. Come on. Oh, and I killed him. Chris, it's not a treadmill. Uh, come on. Alright. One, two, three. Boom! 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 And I wasted another ammo. God damn it. And. There's another zombie there. Are you serious? It looks like something was glowing. And I. Did I kill him? Yes, I did. Okay. Uh. Nothing useful that way yet. Uh, we don't. I don't think we're gonna have enough items. Well, it's locked anyway, so. Like I said, I don't think we were gonna have enough items, so. Let's go down the stairs. And then. And there's another zombie there. One, two, three, four. And he's. Is he dead? Yeah, there's blood on the floor, yay! We got the herb again, which can heal you. And I'm gonna use it because obviously, um. On caution, so. And I'm okay, I'm fine. Well, almost fine. Because it's slightly yellow as well. Yeah, the colour of the the swiggy things that come out uh, uh, also means how much health you have. So if it's gr if it's yellow and you're fine, then you're not too fine. When it's green, then you're fully fine. So, um. Um. Uh, Um, I don't know what to do. Uh, well, I'm gonna get another crest, and then we're gonna. I'm gonna use it to open another door. So I might as well. Oh wait, no, I cannot go through there because it's locked. So maybe not yet. Uh, I don't think we have to. I don't think we'll be able to do that yet. So I just completely forgot. But um. Okay, we'll get that. Then we'll go to that room. Um, on the second floor again. Because that door should be uh, locked, I think. Yeah, it's locked from the inside. Oh, Chris, I don't know. I don't want to look at the door again. Go up again. Let's get out here. Yeah, you've locked it. Uh, that blood on the wall says the same thing as Jill's playthrough, by the way. Uh, I forgot what it was, but I'm, I can't be bothered to read it. Okay. Right, I need to go to the um, downstairs so I can check on Rebecca that uh, still as well even though even though I don't have the emblem with me I can still check on I can still check her so I could have like gone the long way to be honest but uh, this seems quicker um Uh, let's go back to Rebecca real quick to see if we can 
or if we still need longer. I bet we still need longer. Let's see. Chris! Chris! You like it? Now she's playing properly. And Chris is like, hmm, I don't know if it's good. Oh, that was great. But it opens something there. What is that? Yeah, it's something, but we cannot, um... Well, we can't really do this yet because we haven't- I haven't brought my other shield, so I'm gonna go and get that. Uh, I'm gonna get that before doing this, so... <sighs> okay. Uh, and while I'm there, I'm I can also do that generator thing, so... I'll do the generator thing first, and then I'll get the shield. So let's go. Okay, we don't need anything to unlock this door because it's already unlocked. Okay, here we go. An old pump, water. The lid is open. So we just do the same thing right here. There we go. These tentacles are freaking out. And then. Tons more plants in this room as well, so if you ever want to have more um, health, then there you go. Uh, they're right there. So, in fact, I'll combine some. Uh, I'll combine at least one now, so then. I get um, a red one, yeah. So then I can get that other one. So I can combine these. Uh, I'm going to heal myself slightly with this green one here. Uh, okay, there we go. And then, get this key. Another mansion key. There we go. Oh, you can walk from that way as well. Oh, I, I didn't know that. Okay, and now... We'll go back to the item box and get the, um, you know, the uh, shield. So, the emblem. So we need that. And I should open that door as well, but I don't know why I didn't. Do, 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 do. Item box, box, box. Do, do. Okay, there we go. An emblem. Here we go. Lovely. That's lovely. Okay. We got that done. Uh, let's open. Let's unlock this door real quick. There we go. So then, so we can still use the key then. No, not that way, Chris. It's this way. Then we'll go back to where Rebecca is, or was. We don't know if she left. She might still be in there. <laughs> right into the wall. Okay. Um, go here. Is she still here? Yeah, she's still here. What if we talk to her? <laughs> Chris, be careful. Okay. The Chris, not into the wall again. Um. Oh wait, we don't have enough room. <laughs> oh shit, uh, we don't have enough room. Oh my god. Jesus, I have to do a lot more walking again. Uh, I don't. I don't think we'll need the knife anymore. Uh, we'll uh put that away actually. So. Oh my god. 
Wow. I wish there was a nearby item box, but there isn't. You have to do it. This is what I mean by backtracking a lot. Uh, just because there's not enough room in your items. So, I kind of wish there was a way to extend it. But no, they didn't do any of that until Resident Evil 2. I don't know if, I don't know if Resident Evil 3 has that as well. Or Code Veronica, but... Okay, there we go. So, I'm just using the Beretta. So, because we need, we need room to, like... Pull the shield and then put the other shield on, so... Uh, it doesn't replace it immediately. I kind of wish it does. Um, or at least, uh, at least, uh, have one character carrier while your other item slots have, like, something else. I kind of wish that was like that as well. But no Resident Evil game does this. Like, in other games like Resident Evil 4, you can carry way more items. And you can even extend them a lot as well. But then Resident Evil 5 didn't do that, nor did 6. So, or 7 in it. I think 7 kind of did that. And I don't know about Village, because I haven't played Village, but... Okay. Alright, here we go. Uh, the gold emblem. Then it closes, because we're trapped. But we're not. Put the other one on. Boom! It's going back up. Lovely. Chris, are you all right? Yes. No need to touch Chris's belly button. <laughs> it kind of looks like it. <laughs> okay. And then... Uh, yeah, we need to uh, go back to the main room. Well, not the main room, but, you know, the dining room. To put the gold emblem on where the old emblem used to be. Right here. Not there, Chris. Right there. The, the, not the map. <laughs> so then the, the moving clock. So the clock will move. Revealing another key that we need to use. And then after this, we'll, we'll accept. We'll go through the other. Uh, we'll go through the other parts of the mansion. I kind of like we've got a gold, silver and bronze key, it looks like. Yeah, we'll go through the downstairs parts. So we'll go through this way. Uh, I won't have enough... I don't have enough room to get the increment in uh, that room there, so... We'll have to do that later or something, so... When we do have enough room. Uh, it's a map of the first floor. Will you take it? Yes. You absolutely want to. Well, you don't need to, but it is recommended. Oh, this key is only used a few times. Okay. I guess we do have enough room for the increment then. So, because I don't remember using that key with Jill. Maybe it's another thing with Chris. Uh, uh, you have to use items that you never use otherwise. So, I'm not going to kill this zombie. We're not going to come back here anyway, so. Or you can kill him like this. Yeah, you can crush him, and we're fine. Apparently, you have to mash buttons in order to do that. Um, I thought they do it automatically. Uh, no, we're not. Ta we're not going to push that. We're going to go to the door. <gasps> All right, this is where those dogs come back. Oh boy, naughty dogs, naughty doggies. Okay, there we go, and then. Ooh, Chris's face. Okay. Um, but there's an, uh, and more importantly, there's a herb here that we need. So, well, we don't need, but you get the point. Uh, can we open this door? Yes, we can. Uh, we can unlock it. Okay. I'm gonna quickly get a clip that's in here because there is a clip in this uh, corridor. But we need to kill these dogs first. Well, I guess you don't need to, but it's recommended to. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. I'm so close to death here. Oh, gotcha, lol. 
<laughs> the dog is like in the wall, kind of. Can you see that? It's like close to the wall. Wow. It's like a ghost dog. All right, there's only one clip in this room. It's this one here. 140, lovely. Chris's face, okay. Uh, there's just, it's just like herbs out there, so. But I'll go out there to kill some dogs, so. We will come back out here. Okay. Ugh. Okay. There we go. Lovely. And then we're gonna kill the other dog. Just out here. Oh, whoa, okay. And that's... Ha, there we go. It's good thing giving those dogs. Okay. Right, let's go in here. Uh, again, this is the bathroom. There's usually nothing in this room, but thanks to this hack, uh, something from the prototype. Oh, wait. There is something here. Oh, a small lockpick. Oh, okay. Well, I guess for Chris at least, but aside from that, there's nothing useful here. Uh, in the original version, uh, any normal versions. But in the prototype, the bathtub... With a, yeah, you can, you can do this. You can only do this in prototypes, usually. But thanks to this hack, it's been it's been restored into the into this version. So, and what do we get inside this? We get another clip, but in the actual game, you get nothing. Uh, usually, uh, I don't think you have an option to unplug the bath or something. So yeah, that's kind of cool that the hack adds that as well. Um, uh, we cannot really go through there yet. And then right here, we can unlock a door. First off, we'll kill this zombie! And waste an ammo. Do -do 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 -do. Right, they're both dead. You've unlocked it. Uh, do we have... No, we don't have enough room for anything else. So, what we need to do now is... Um... Now, of course, lockpicks are... Uh... I believe they're only used for... I don't know if they're used for doors, but obviously they're used for items, so... And in Chris's playthrough, you have to use them to go through. You don't have an infinite lockpick like Jill has. Uh, so we'll put the increments away. Combine these, so then... Again, combining items is very useful. Uh, we're about to do... Um, we're about to do something, so we'll use the crest. Then, what we're going to do is... Because we're about to go in here again. Uh, this is the, the picture puzzle again. Uh, growing to be an old, so... And there's crows here still, so... Uh, so we got to read these. A newborn baby, so yes. We want to push that first. Then it's a young man. No. No. What's this one? Picture of an infant. Yes, that one's next. And this one is a lovely boy. Yes. And young man is next. And it's this one. Picture of a tiled middle-aged man, yes, and then, then the last one is the big one there. Of a really old man. Bold looking old man, and then, right here, end of life. Yes, there we go, first try again. 
Again, if you don't do this correctly, the crows will come after you and kill, try to kill you. So you want to escape from the room quick. Got a star crest. And oh, it actually auto aims on the crows above. I think you can shoot them from there as well. But let's be nice to the crows today. I know I want to eat them so much, but still. What a crow, a crow pie dinner. <laughs> I don't know. Um, right, and then we're going to put these crests uh, on. Uh, okay. It's a dog. Gotcha. <laughs> gotcha. Naughty dog. Yeah, I know. It's where we're just going to need to put the... Um... No, I don't need to read more of it. There we go. Lovely. Yeah, so we put those on out of the way. So we need two more, of course. So I'm gonna um, an itchy head. Okay. No, no, Chris, stop. And no, you cannot unlock this door yet. It's still later in the game where you have to do that. So yeah. But because we've got more room keys, we can still um, go through places. So I'm going to get my lockpick back. Oh, wait. Uh, I won't have enough room, though, will I? Not really. Okay. Uh, so I'll leave that behind. Because some items are still going to be clips. So. So, yeah. Here we go. You have used the mansion key. Yes, that's a good. There's a zombie there. Oh my god. And he's biting me. Get off me. Get off me, you naughty boy. And he's dead. Yay. And uh, what's over here? Oh, another ink ribbon. I'll not get that yet. In case there's something very important to get. I need to push this. It's too heavy to move. Oh, uh, I get it now. So we push this to lower the water. So it lowers the water down, and then we push it after. Oh, I get it now. Because it was too heavy before. Okay. Let's push that out of the way. And we push this all the way here. So then we can open this. Uh, it's just shells. Uh, let me see if there's anything of it, ever, anything else useful first. Research as well, okay. Unless this is not really a useful room at all, I don't know. It's well arranged, okay. Well, in that case, I'll get these. There is something useful in the other room, but I'll come back. Uh, since, um... Okay. Okay, we'll go back to the item box. And then, go downstairs, like a creep. Oh god. I'm so a bit tired, but still. Uh, we're gonna um And we're gonna open this box again. Uh again I'll combine these uh both, so there we go. There we go. I don't know if I still need the small key, so... We'll just, uh, get out. Uh, 
Let's uh, walk up the stairs and then. Old school style. <laughs> okay, we walk slowly because Chris is Chris is pretending this is a treadmill. When it's not, it's a it's a mansion. But not the one Luigi went in. So uh, Yeah, there's something here. This is this is what you want. The lighter. You only need this once in the game, I believe. You might, I think, you, I think you do need it more in Chris's playthrough, but I'm not quite sure on that. Right, that's more shotgun shells. Um, oh, Chris, this is not a treadmill. Oh my god! And it's just the red herb there. Okay. Chris, what is wrong with you? Okay, um, yeah, we'll come back for that red herb like, way later, so let's go, because we still got the keys, we'll, we'll go in that room before the first boss, or oh, I don't know if we can, so, you yeah, we've used the magic key, we'll unlock that, but we can't have anything because there's no room, but let's say we go in here, and... Okay, let's see. Oh. Richard from Bravo Team. And he's dead already. Okay, so we don't get a cutscene. But we need that key one more time, so... Uh, we'll uh, go and unlock the door, but we'll not go in there. Uh, so then we have enough room. Uh, for more stuff, so... We'll kill the zombie first of all. So, no, Chris! There we go. Oh, shit! Vomiting on me. That's disgusting. That is a dirty thing to do. Uh, uh, we'll check there later. Again, Chris, it's not a treadmill, it's, um... Okay. Uh, I'll use that. Okay, there we go. And then... I'm gonna get this, um... I'm gonna get another crest here. By pushing these statues again. So yeah, most of the puzzles are the same, but there are quite a few new ones, I believe. So... Okay, there we go. The Chris, what is wrong with you? P -p -p push it! Just push the... Oh my god! There we go. And then we press the... Then we press the button, I was trying to itch my arm. Yeah, push that. There we go. And then it opens this. That we can use. Now I'm going to go back to the item box. And then what I'm going to do is I'm going to go to one of the other rooms that we've unlocked with the key to then get a useful weapon. So... Here we go. Well, first off, I can do something else uh, while I have the lighter on me because uh, then I can uh, save the lighter for like later or something. I don't know if I'll need it again, but all right. Oh, I can't itchy head. Um, <coughs> oh boy, that was a good burp. Because um, here we light this up. We get the map of the second floor. <laughs> Oh, I got hiccups. It's a map of the second floor. Will you take it? Yeah. We got it. There we go. There 
There we go. And now we're going to uh, go back to the first floor. Um... Back to the item box. I could put that uh, to the things, but uh, to save time, we'll not do that uh, until later. So, it's so the thought of getting a useful weapon first, and then go and fight the snake boss. Um, well, I don't know if we can get the bazooka, though, so I'll have to see if I can. Um, right, first I'll combine those again. There we go. It's very useful when you do that. Uh, we'll take the small key in case, and then... There we go. Okay, there we go. And then... Uh, I don't know which way to go. Um, which way do I go? From here. Uh, let's go. Let's do this. So we're about to get the shotgun. And just like in Jill's playthrough, we'll need to go through uh, this. So. so we need to get the broken one, uh, which doesn't work at all. Yeah, you can't do shit with it. Uh, so then to replace it with the one that does work. So then you don't get the uh, crushing ceiling that can kill you. So we need to do that again. Yeah, most some of the stuff are the same thing. But others you have to do other things as well. Or you have extra things that you need to do. So in fact, we've still got one of the keys. So we'll unlock one of the other doors while we're here. We'll unlock this door here. If you use the mansion key. And we don't need it! Oh my god! In fact, we'll go in there now, actually. Uh, to see what we can do. Here we go. And there's more clips. There's another clip here. Like, I think uh, when I first played this, uh, my father called them magazines. And I, and I always thought magazines were just, you know, what you read. But apparently they're also uh, things for your gun as well. We use the small key. Yes, this is one of the things you use the small key with. Oh, it's just shotgun ammo. Well, we've got plenty more uh, room there. So, um, so yeah, uh, if you don't have the small keys, you cannot open these with Chris. With Jill, you can, but with Chris, you can't because you have to get these small keys. There's another zombie there. Smash him then. Yeah, smash his head. There we go. Uh, let's get this increment. So then we don't have to come back in this room again then. So we can get all items now. We'll combine those green herbs. And just because we got the... Uh, we, we have unlocked a key after finishing the game with Jill does not mean we can go in there with Chris. You don't have the key for this room. So, yeah. You have to finish the game as that character to go in that room. I, th I think it's just for costume changing, I think. Uh, I could be wrong, though, but... Yeah, that's what I think it is. So, um... Okay, let's combine these. To make a green, green herb. Here we go. Doo -doo -doo. Now let's get that broken shotgun. Shoot. With, no, not people, no. Uh, zombies, of course. And then we're close to a sa uh, save room, a save and item room, so... An item and save room, so... We can use that again to, um... So then we can use that again in order to, um... Uh, save on what we have, so... We're gonna... We'll go get the broken shotgun first, and then... So we go here. Open the door, Chris. There we go. Uh, not just stand there. And then the shotgun's right here. 
Oh, well, first we get a clip. Okay. And then... Broken shotgun that we cannot use. I believe there's increments here as well. The desk is locked. Oh. Yeah, you need a lock pick. Okay. Uh, we can't use it then. I'm guessing it's just more increments though or something. It could be. I don't know. I forgot. And also the amount of increments you get, it depends on the version as well and the difficulties. Um, the original version, the Japanese version, you get three increments, but in the international version you get two. So um, uh, they changed that in Director's Cut English version where it's three on normal mode, but then on beginner mode it's four you get. Uh, I, I don't know what it is in a range slash advanced mode, but... Um, uh, okay, um, put these shells away and all. No. There we go. So then I'll have enough space here as well. Do, 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 do. Do, 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 do. Then we need to go back uh, to the, um, the crushing ceiling room so we can get the normal shotgun there um here we go there we go then Go back here. <laughs> or go around that, apparently. <laughs> okay. Alright. Get in the door. I've still got an itchy head for some reason. I have no idea why. Oh, Chris, what is wrong with you? Oh, Chris's face again. <laughs> okay, uh, we're back here. So then uh, we can go back in this room and finally get the proper shotgun. We have enough room uh, to replace it, so we should have. Yeah, we do. We've got plenty of space. Well, two slots anyway. So here we go. Let's do this. Let's get the shotgun. That does work. And then put the broken one on, because it's the same weight. And then bam. Got it. Now we can leave this room. And then... I don't think we can get the bazooka yet, so we're gonna have to, um... So we're going to have to um, uh, do this with the shotgun, so we're going to get the shotgun ammo. Uh, then again, we need more space and all, so... Uh, let's, uh, okay, and I'll use that as well. I'm going to have to try and damage Lust as well, because obviously we get poisoned, so... Uh, is there anything we need? Aside from those shells, is there anything else we need? No, I don't think there is. Um, there is, of course, these mixed herbs, but we'll use those ones. Um, let's move things around here. There we go. Or oh, actually. There we go. Organized much better. So, we're going to... Uh, now we're going to go and try and fight the boss. Well, we might go in a room before the boss first, and then... Uh, fight the boss after, before it, I mean, so. Because uh, I am going to save state this. I've not done any save states yet for this video. Wow, I'm surprised. I'm also surprised that I had a no death run and all. Um, I did take damage a lot in the Jill playthrough, but still. Something is written on the wall. 
I can't breathe. Save me from this pain. Okay. And thankfully, we have unlocked the door, so... We don't need to uh, worry about unlocking doors. Because Chris is not the master of unlocking. Jill is. So... There's that. Oh, and there's this herb as well. We'll get that. And we don't have enough room. Well, in that case, then, I will fight the boss first, and then... Well, actually, no, because, obviously, uh, if I take damage, then, um... Uh, then I'll, um... In fact, we need, we need more of those room anyway, so... For one of the, uh, things, so... We'll go in that room after, so... Here we go. And then I'll save state after the cutscene. Right, we'll change our gun. Here we go. Snake! Let's yawn the snake! Let's save state here. <laughs> On this beautiful pose. There we go! <laughs> Lovely. And I can't shoot from there, so... Oh my god. Oh, I'm shooting him from here. And you do get poisoned again, so we've got to be careful. Once again, so. Um, so I'd say we walk a bit. Oh, no, not that way. Oh my god, Chris. Run. Run away. Oh shit. <laughs> this is so odd. Okay, then we need to run. Oh, I got bitten. And every time you get bitten, no matter how minor it is, you always poison yourself from this, uh, from this one. So. Oh, shit. <laughs> Wow, I shot him and I got bitten at the same time. Okay. Okay, there we go. Oh, God! Oh, no. It is possible to do this with the knife, but it's very hard. And, of course, I got poisoned. Like, you could think... Yeah, you could get poisoned now and just heal yourself a lot, but... It takes a while for you to cure yourself from the poison, so that's why I'm trying to do this damageless, which is very hard. And if I was not using save states, this will take a while for me to get back to, so... Okay, shot him. Run! Oh my god, did I get bit? Oh my god, I did! I did not see the blood, though. Oh my god. Wow. <laughs> yeah, this is harder with Chris, because we don't have the bazooka. This is easier with the bazooka. Oh, I've got bitten! <laughs> no! And even if you heal yourself from there, you still... So I'm, gonna, I'm still gonna try and do this damage less. Fuck. <laughs> This is so hard. Wow. At least we got. At least we don't have to look, watch the cutscene longer, so. Oh, what the fuck, Chris? Facing the wrong way. No! <laughs> oh no! I knew this will take forever still. Alright, here we go. Shoot twice. Oh, or not. Okay. Uh, I'm gonna get bitten, aren't I? Yeah, I knew it. Alright, here we go. That's why it's best when you're here. You shoot him twice here. Or not. <laughs> and get bitten. Um, okay. Because you can't shoot from there. It's weird. Like, even if you shoot up, he'll still try to get you. So... So we have to have another unique way. 
of doing this. Oh no! Oh no. No, oh, I knew it. <laughs> yeah, this is very hard. You can do this with the knife as well, but it's so hard. Even damageless. You won't be able to do this. Okay. Okay. Here we go. Oh no. I can't see myself. Oh no! Oh no! Oh no! Oh no! Oh no! Oh no! No 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 Oh shit! He's coming for me! This is so hard. Oh my god, he's there. Yeah, I knew I'd get bitten. It's so hard because every time he faces you, he always tries to bite you. It's almost hard to dodge. There we go. Oh, why are you facing that way, Chris? Come on. Oh no, I'm gonna get bitten! Oh, 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 I'm, I'm dodging, I'm dodging! Oh, that was still poisoned, oh my god. <laughs> this is so hard. Oh my god. Okay, three hits. Then run away. Shoot in there few times and then he's struggling to get past oh my god I actually no nah. yeah it's still hard oh no oh I got him wow yes Oh my god, that was so hard. <laughs> wow. We got him, though. Damageless. Uh, not a lot of effort than the Jill one, but wow. Still, we killed him. But we didn't kill him, but we defeated him. This uh, phase, anyway, so... Mooncrest, okay. And I can't use that. Okay, if you do get poisoned, you will get a cutscene outside and then you will have to play as Rebecca Chambers to, like, get serum or something for Chris. Uh, and obviously we don't really want that, so... We'll st I'll see what's in this room anyway. If there's nothing useful, then... Nah, we don't really need it. Yeah, we'll fuck it. Uh, okay. Right, it's another clip, so... That's obviously useful. Anything else? No. What about... It? If, after we push this. It's too dark to see anything. Oh, fuck it. We'll just, we'll just fuck off then. Um. Alright. Um. There we go. And <laughs> we don't need to look at him again. Come on. We we'll just have to leave him there. And now we can um, go outside in the courtyard. But we'll do that in the next video, of course. So we'll just uh, go to the item room and then we'll finish the video off. So how about that? Uh, we'll change the guns as well. There we go. Go do 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 We'll put away the shotgun as well because we don't really need that uh quite yet, so Well, uh we use it for snake, but that's about it. And it's only because it deals more damage. But it is much easier with the bazooka, but obviously we don't have the bazooka with us, so Yeah. Uh, so we'll put that crest there. 
And yeah, so that'll be it for today's video, guys. Okay? So next time on Resident Evil, we will do uh, the rest of the game, and hopefully, um, we can do stuff. So I shall see you guys next time, James. Bye. See you guys next time. Bye.